Crystal, you have a lot of friends, man. Shut up, Danny. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Yeah, it's it, this is actually really nice. This is feeling a lot more like the old community, like that that used to be around. Like this is feeling more. I'm feeling more welcome because I really was not feeling like I was part of this community for a while there. Come on, Crystal. You know you're you know you're good talent. Stop it. No, because it was. Be, I'll tell you. I'll tell you why too. It's because like, I love. I was. I was DMing with Chad, too. and and he, I told him he he said something about Kermit. <clears> he <throat> said something about having his new header and all the pictures that were up there. And I'm like that right there. I go. That's why I don't like this place being called Kermit Town. I said because you've isolated all of those people on that fucking yeah. header of yours, and it put it, it it sets them out like like it's there's ball, something ball, wrong yeah. with us. Like there there's freak there freak shows up on there. And, All about, and, uh, you know, I've told them about I, I said it's times. like a fucking whack pack. I said, I said it's like a fucking whack pack, and I don't, I don't support that. Me. That's one of the reasons why I didn't listen to Stern, why I didn't like Stern, is because I don't believe that there should be people isolated and, and exploited and made fun of because of their, you know, their whatever idiosyncrasies about them and he and chad was like crystal you're totally <laughs> shut yeah. up Daniel. <laughs> oh, Danny. that's, that's the worst word to use <laughs> okay, yeah. god damn it i'm gonna fucking mute Danny. i can't i can't mute Danny. no because then you guys are gonna talk you guys are gonna talk over each other don't mute Danny. yeah I so then I'm like, he said, well, you know, you fit the fucking, you fit the mold, Crystal. You're one of them, too. And I was like, I don't think that anybody should be on that, on a wall of, of whack packer. Like, it's just, I don't know. And I said, so what are you telling me? You guys just yeah. laugh at me? And he's like, yeah, look at your life. Your life yeah. is a fucking mess. You know what you <laughs> should tell him to go? By your fucked up life. <laughs> you should tell him to go fuck up himself. I mean, he, you know, I like Chad, but for the same reason I hate him. But see, but this is the thing. I didn't go into this. I didn't start doing broadcasting. Like, I didn't put my no face way. out there. I didn't open up my entire fucking life and bare my soul, literally bare my soul. I have put everything that I've ever done out there on air in front of a live audience yeah. of however many people, I don't know, uh, all across the world. And, and I've, I've shared that with people. In, and I had a mission. And, and I... I feel like I, I didn't do that because I wanted someone to go, oh, look, at, there's a fucking train wreck. She makes me laugh because she makes yeah. me feel better about my fucking life. Let's listen. On one hand, <laughs> on one hand, on, exactly. I do. Uh, one, there's, on one hand, I do feel like, hey, look, at, if you feel better about your life because you watched my life for a second, you're like, God, I guess I could be worse. <laughs> then good, good thing. I'm happy. Good, more power to you. I still helped you out in a way because I fucking helped you look at your life and Put it in perspective. But is it offensive? Yeah, it's fucking offensive. It makes me mad. It hurts my feelings. 